everyone, it's Naika and I'm here today with my beautiful queen, my mother. This is Vina. Hello everybody. I'm inviting my mom on today to tell the story of my great uncle, your uncle Gerard. My uncle Gerard. The whistle in the beginning of the song is from my mother's uncle. And so I'm gonna let her tell you guys the story a little bit about who he was. And yeah, c'est bon, c'est bon. I didn't have a normal childhood with a father and a mother. I had to live in my grandmother's house with my grandmother, my grandfather, my mother, my father, Uncle Gerard, who never got married, and my Aunt Anne Marie, who raised me. So it was a very vibrant house, always something happening, even though it was very crazy at times. My grandparents had a lot of children, and a lot of them died at birth, and they were left with a lot of girls. So my grandfather was a very hardworking man, and he wanted to have a boy. So when Uncle Jerry finally came, he says, wow, this is my boy, he's gonna take over my business. This is it. So unfortunately for my grandfather, Gérard was a very unique person and who assumed his uniqueness at times where it was not really acceptable, like he should have been born in this era. Chega never wanted to live a normal life like everybody. He refused the nine to five. He refused to get married and he wanted to live his artistry. He was a very, very good storyteller, such a good storyteller that he never had to buy a car because people would line up in front of our house honking and waiting for Shira to go out with him. And he lived that night. He slept in the day and he lived that night. He entertained at night. He gave shows in the clubs, in the theaters. He was an artist all the way. And when he was little, he fell and he chipped his tooth. And very young, he learned that with his fingers, using that tooth, he could make a sound that made him sound like a flute. So he started whistling and he became known as the human flute in Haiti. And in all his uh, shows, he would whistle, he would be on the radio, he would be everywhere. But still, he didn't want to work the nine to five. He didn't want anything that society says that uh, we have to do. So a lot of people condemned him. A lot of people thought of him as weird, but he didn't care. He lived his life the way he wanted and he was a very very unique person he went to new york city to try to make it big but of course without the his support. family the support of his family in those days it was very difficult because there was no social media or anything so all he managed to do was leave behind him everybody who knows him and a record that Nika found with me Are you found you yeah 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 cleaning my mother's house in Haiti. So Naika had the very good idea of using one of Jerry's whistling, the human flute, as he was called, for her song, which I'm very happy because even if it's late, he will get a chance to share with the world. Yes. That's the character of Jira. Unfortunately, he smoked a lot of cigarettes and he, he died at, you know, way too young. But I have to say that at the end of his life, he was a little bit sad. He said that he regret not leaving children behind and you know, but you can't have everything. He really, really lived the way he wanted against everybody, against a close-minded society on an island. Everybody from the island, we are very particular. <laughs> and he did what he wanted. Finally, his music, I hope, reaches the whole world. To Naika, I hope you enjoy Giro. And that's it. I miss him and when I go, on the other side, I hope he'll be one of the first person that I meet because he influenced my life very much. What did you think when you first heard the song after I wrote it? Oh, it was it. very touching and I think we all cried. I think we all cried because when he whistled, he whistled with his fingers like this, sound like a flute and it came from his guts. He was a true artist. Thank okay. you, mommy. You're welcome, my I darling. Love you. I adore you. God bless you. This is Vina and Naika tuning out. Thank you for telling us the story. You're very welcome. You. I love you more.